Hey guys, remember, uh, remember Project Zomboid I played a while back? Well, I want to make a new s a series on this game actually. Just took me a little bit before I decided to do it. If I die, the series ends. <laughs> I did say that last episode, but I decided why not try again. Well, the series for this character specifically. I am not good at this game at all. Let me just wear this. Uh, visor forward, why not? Uh, toolbox. I can open this, I think. Let me just equip it, I think. I'm very confused on how this game works. Alright, it's a wrench. My new weapon. And then, of course, I just dropped the box. Alright, cool. This is my new strat on how to not die in this game. I'll grab the kitchen knife, the empty bowl for some water. And then this house is practically going to be my deathbed if I don't get out. Very, making this very honest with you. This place sucks to spawn and there is literally nothing in this house for me that I can really use. So, uh... Yeah, let me just quickly remove the looting button. I don't want to accidentally run into a horde by accident because this place is a freaking... Yeah, alright, that house is barricaded, that house is a zombie nearby. I don't want to make any risky maneuvers. That house also has a zombie nearby, but a lot less prevalent, I guess. A lot less close. And of course, that side also has a lot of zombies, so why not try this house too? I'll try to get there. We're starting in mid-row. Yes. Okay, finally I got the window open. Let me just, uh, I want to close the window. Alright! This is our new abode. <clears throat> Alright, I did not expect to find what I needed exactly. A can opener to actually open up the canned food. Which doesn't rot in this game. Which makes that very useful. And one meat cleaver is also very useful. And my word, there's a lot of useful stuff in here. Uh, I did try this series again, but since that episode ended with me basically dying, playing Doom Guy. <laughs> With a shotgun that I found in the first house with 27, 27, 22 bullets in it. That was an uh, interesting experience. Uh, so, uh, yeah, this house also isn't that good, so I'm gonna leave this house. Just not from the way I came in. Not the way I came out of. Uh, I actually wanna try and go to the house with the car nearby it. Because there could be a chance I could hotwire the car, or that the car keys are in it, so I can start trying to find better resources elsewhere. But there are two zombies there, and not much anywhere else, so... Um, hope that light footing of yours doesn't tr track the free zombies. You suck at light footing. You suck. You sucked completely at light footing. Do I have to really start combat now because I just decided to take a risk? Yes, I do. Oh crap! Heart attack lane. This was a mistake. I can't believe it. That was, uh. Disastrous. Close. Almost. Death. I almost found death there. I'm just gonna go back. I'm just gonna go to this house now. That looks weird. Get your head crushed in. Oh crap! Stupid. I 
my bit. Uh, no, just a laceration. There's a chance I could have gotten bit from that, but there, uh, I could have gotten infected from that, but I haven't been infected yet, so, uh, rip Rooney. Let's hope I get lucky. This was a disaster. Oh my word, I hope this, this doesn't become deaf. Uh... I'll know whether I'm infected or not based on a few factors, but uh, long gloves, I need to wear this. A leather jacket will give me. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up! <sighs> Alright. Alright, alright, that was disastrous. I'm probably. I, there's a 25% chance you're infected when you get a laceration. So, uh, yeah. Let's hope I got lucky. Let me fill this up with some water. This game is hard, man. Complicated, but hard. Heavy load? What are you even holding that's so le heavy? Is it the satchel? What's in it? Alright, let's eat the peanut butter sandwich. Great. I can put some of the stuff in the satchel. Let's see how big, how much stuff I can fit in here. Meat cleaver. Alright, my bandage hasn't become dirty yet. You can get an infection if you don't. Deal with that. Uh, protection. Temperature is fine. Info. Oh yeah, the, the character's name is Howard. He's a police officer. He has these traits. I'm not driving, so that's fine. <laughs> um, so... Oh, wrong button. I'm used to other games. So yes, I have... I am... There's a chance I'm infected. I have an umbrella as a weapon, a satchel, and I'm in pain. The perfect mix of a disastrous beginning to the zombie survival horde. Well, that's definitely not a house. I'm going to... I'm going to be going to a different house. Let's hope you're quiet enough not to trigger that zombie over there. Alright, let's make this our base. Because I can't deal with any more crap today. I have water, I have lots of magazines, I've got television. This house is more open than, than a camping site because of the lack of stuff being closed. So, I'm about to switch off these lights to give myself a better chance. And I'm going to hide in the bathroom with lights off as well. So, that happened. Ah, <laughs> uh, man, there is a chance I can get infected from this. Not the, you. There's normal infection and there's the zombie bite infection. Which, uh, might add, you there. If you get a scratch on you, you, you there's a chance you're infected. If you get a laceration, there's twenty five percent chance you get infected, and it's a, you're bitten one hundred percent. So I have a 1 in 4 chance of not dying to this today, and I am... Oh, 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 I hope not. This was a good run at the start of it. Um... Um... Okay, let me just see... Jeans? Nah, no, this pants I'm wearing is fine. Alright, so zombies can ignore your house, and one of them has gotten near my house. I have... Are you kidding me, son? No, they're not. There comes the horde, literally bashing through the door. 
I thought I was being quiet, but no. No, I was not. At all. This has been an eventful day. I have not eaten anything, and, but I don't think my character is hungry. I have been scrounging around for resources. I'm hoping one of these plates will be a base for me. This has been an experience, one filled with disaster and dismay. Now I've got a whore beating down my neck as I got... Because I accidentally touched a freaking zombie hard. So uh, yeah, that was uh, my mistake. Uh, I'm sorry, zombies. So I just triggered every zombie in the tr in the on the block. Well, this comes around, doesn't it? All right, I'm gonna try and start trying to walk away, sneak away too. Maybe I can get through the house. I hope so, because the horde is about to come bashing down my head. From multiple angles, too. There is no real escape for me, is there? Not in this instance. Uh, okay. Maybe there's a chance, a chance, a chance, a chance. <sighs> let me through, let me through. I need to just run. I need to run through the woods. I know you're... I know you're hot, moist. Oh, you're sweaty. We've been running around in like the summer heat. Howard, Todd. It just works, as I say, as I basically die from this. But it, you can sneak away by. You can sneak away by entering the trees and such, and by losing sight like that. Ah, I can't avoid fighting forever. Let's go. No, don't. You dare. Be serious. Be serious to get up now. What the? Get this phone on the floor now. Alright, doesn't seem like any other zombies in nearby. Alright, I'm gonna try and see the state of this place. And I have uh, made mistakes, I believe. What the hell? Is the zombie's pathfinding broken? What? There it is. Shove, shove match time. Shove, 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 shove. Really? I literally just shoved one of you to the ground, now the other one's falling back. Get your head stomped on. Are ya kidding me? No. No, you know what's great. Goodbye. I've had my time with you. I, I should've just ran into one of these buildings and then... Alright. I, I have some time to quickly check if there's something here for me that I can take. Nothing. There's nothing here for me to take. This could've been a good base. Because of how roomy it is, but nah. I have to dip out the other way and just leave again. 
Oh. oh man, the house is open. Oh no, that's not an open house. All right, I think I might have gone away from the horde for a little bit. You kidding me? You you kidding me? Oh my word! I need to learn how to get rid of the horde easier. I literally got rid of one issue, and now I'm getting lambasted with other issues. I'm surprised you still have co I still have the ability to run and fight after all that. Um. So yeah, I need to lose line of sight of those two and uh, those da 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 da. Da 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 Okay, cool. Let me just uh Uh I've been running all day. Doop do doop 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 do doop 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 do doop 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 do 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 My word. Um. Yeah. All right. Let me just keep walking then. So that was a military con, military man. And okay, time for me to escape another way. Please don't walk with me straight into another horde. This is the only way I can get out at this point. Alright, sorry I'm whispering guys, I'm now just, I'm starting to get into character, I guess, a little bit. Oh, freak. Oh, ha, ha, ha. If I may get away from one and now three others join the fray. I've been running around for about an hour now. My character is exhausted. I'm exhausted. I'm fighting another horde of the undead. I won't even mind sleeping on the floor in the woods, just so I can survive another day. Great. At least I know I've got food, I've got water. Yep. That makes sense. I'm not risking it for a chocolatey biscuit and- Okay, it's- it's starting to happen now. This is- either I escape now and be able to rest the night, or I'm dead for the entire day. Because now I'm getting exerted. Meaning my physical capabilities are becoming weaker. Oh wait, I'm, I'm, no, I'm no longer exerted anymore. Cool. Exerted. Is that the word? Is that how you say it? I think so. Perfect base. Not a lot of zombies nearby either. I 
I made it. 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 I made it to a place I can actually stay. Oh my word, I made it. I actually made it to a place I could stay the night without getting completely attacked by an entire horde of zombies. Oh, I made it. I'm eating pickles. I made it home. To a place I can go home at least. I'm now just dealing with my hunger and such. Oh, even a can opener. Uh, let me open the map real quick. Let's see how far I've traveled. I think I started over here. Alright, to make sure I don't get lost. Uh, oh, wait, I don't have a pen or a pencil. Alright, cool. Uh, but I did find one. I could have picked one up. Unlock the door. Okay. Alright, guys. That's the end of the video, I think. Let me wear this one as well. No, Lumberjack shirt is pretty good. Alright, that's the end of the video, guys. I survived, I think. I didn't die. The zombies aren't breaking down my door as we speak. I have some rags to deal with my injuries with. I have a sink. I have pancake mix. I have a water bucket. I can deal with water issues. That could have arise from not having water. I'm becoming extremely over encumbered. Which makes sense. Uh, so where 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 is everything? Okay, the bucket of water. That can get get inserted into the refrigerator for me to drink at a later date. And uh <laughs> oh, I'll store the corned canned beef. The magazine sticking with me, so I can have entertainment. A bowl of water. Can opener sticks with me. Tomato paste can also go into the fridge. And saucepan with water. The satchel has its own collection of canned food. But yeah. I made it! I made it to a place I could call home. I made it, guys. I made it to a safe ish location. Ah. <sighs> I wish I could just close the windows though. That's like the only wish I have. Because there's still a chance zombies could see through that. The window, I mean. So, not perfect, perfect. At all. But. I made it! <laughs> After basically running for an entire day, I, I made it. Oh, let me take that. There's no need for me. I'm never. I'm not coming back up here again after I grab this, so I can use that to shut off some spots on the top second floor that they could spot me from. Same with here. I would like to remove these curtains and put them on the... Yes! Yes, I have a home base now. Oh, let's go. I have a home base. I have a uh, acoustic guitar too. Must have been a musician's pl place I was at, or just someone with a like hobby in hobby here. And yes, okay. Let me take this as well. Let me remove these curtains as well. I can't let any light at the bottom reach me at the bottom. I can't let any light in in the building. 
I want this place to be my base. I have a lot of food. I have a water supply. One I can build up for a little bit. And I can shut down the, all of the really bad spots where I could be seen through. So let me just close the curtain. And, uh... Oh yeah, I still, I'm still injured. And there's still a chance that I can be infected. But I hope not. Especially after that whole day. Of just disaster. Now the only spot open is the door. Sadly, but I think I can just avoid the door area for a little while. And I have a, a few weapons here too. Cool. This is my new safe house, guys. We have fought long. We have fought hard. We have almost died at certain points. I think this is how I'll end this episode, since we've probably been recording for a long while now. So, yeah. Morning time, and, um, that's the end of the video, I think, yeah. Let me just close the door. And, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of stress and, uh, stuff and I'll be seeing you guys in the next one yeah yeah this place is my new safe house let's go <laughs> catch you all on the flip side goodbye I'm hiding the bathroom <laughs> um, but uh, yeah that's the end of the video I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.